friends welcome to Institute of Banking Excellence. Today we are going to test our knowledge by attempting some question. Before starting the video if you like our videos please press the like button, subscribe to our channel and share it with your friends. Then don't forget to press the bell icon so that you can get daily notifications whenever we post a new video. Without wasting much time let's get started. Question 1 The Reserve Bank of India has advised banks to link retail loans with external benchmark World Economic Forum the 1st of October 2019. Which among the following is not a benchmark against which the banks can set their lending rates? A repo rate. B. 3-month treasury bill rate. C. 6-month treasury bill rate. D. 6 months MIBOR. Answer is 6 months MIBOR. Question 2 The banks are free to decide spread over the external benchmark while linking lending rates with external benchmark as per recent RBI guidelines. The components of spread except credit risk premium can be altered. Of once every year. B. Once every 6 months. C. Once every 2 years. D. Once every 3 years. Answer is once every 3 years. Question 3 One of your customer has taken housing loan with interest rate being MCLR based. With linking of lending rates on housing loans to external benchmark, the customer comes forward to get his loan converted from MCLR based to external benchmark linked. Which of the following is the main requirement for permitting him conversion? 1. The interest on his loan shall be floating and not fixed. 2. The sanction terms provide for prepayment of loan without any prepayment charges. 3. The switchover shall be treated as pre-closure of existing facility. A. All of the above. B. 1. And. 2. C2 and 3. D1 and 3. Answer is 1 and 2. Question 4. While making payment to a pensioner, your bank has paid an amount of rupees 15,000 in excess to his monthly pension of rupees 12,000 per month which he has withdrawn from the account. The pensioner has also expressed his inability to adjust the account with immediate effect. In the absence of consent from the pensioner, how will you recover the same? A. You will file suite for recovery. B. You will recover rupees 12,000 from next pension and rupees 3,000 for his following pension payment. C. You will recover rupees 4,000 pm till the recovery in full is made. D. You will recover in a staggered manner as mutually agreed between the bank and the pensioner. Answer is you will recover rupees 4,000 per month till the recovery in full is made. Question 5 Pension except for the month of March can be paid. A. On last working day of the month. B. On second last working day of the month. C. On last two working days of the month in a staggered manner. D. On last four working days of the month in a staggered manner. The answer is on last four working days of the month in a staggered manner. Question 6. Sweet revolution, is related with. A. Reforms in sugar sector. B. Sweet potato farming. C. Beekeeping. D. Clean ocean movement. The answer beekeeping. Question 7 The IDFC Bank has acquired business of an NBFC and consequent to acquisition of business, the name of the bank has been changed. Which of the following is correct name is entered in second schedule to the Reserve Bank of India Act, 1934? A. IDFC First Bank Limited. B. IDFC First Bank Limited. C. IDFC Bank Limited. D. IDFC T First Bank Limited. Answer is IDFC First Bank Limited. Question 8 Who among the following is CEO of UIDAI? A. Ajay Bhushan Pandey. B. Nandan Nilakani. C. Ajay Singh Natwar. D. J. Satyanarena. Answer is Ajay Bhushan Pandey. Question 9 UIDAI is a statutory authority formed under the aegis of A. Ministry of Communication and Information Technology. B. Ministry of Home Affairs. C. Nidhi Ayog. D. Ministry of Urban Development. Answer is Ministry of Home Affairs. Question 10 Which of the following is recognized by RBI as Self-Regulatory Organization and Industry Association for the Microfinance Industry? A. SIDBI. B. Swayot. C. SWA Don. D. Sabalamban. Answer is SWA Don. Question 11 The personal loan which is a part of consumer loan will attract risk weight of as per latest RBI guidelines. A. 50%. B. 75%. C. 100%. D. 125%. Answer is 100%. Question 12 In a Tier 1 city, you can withdraw an amount up to in cash through point of sale POS device at any merchant establishment designated by your bank. A. Rupees 1000. B. Rupees 2000. C. Rupees 3000. D. Rupees 5000. Answer is Rupees 1000. Question 13 Reserve Bank of India releases financial stability report on a monthly basis. B. Weekly basis. 
C. Half yearly basis. D. Yearly basis. Answer is half yearly basis. Question 14 The provision coverage ratio of all Indian scheduled commercial banks is on the 31st of March 2019 stands at a 55%. B. 60%. C. 74%. D. 50%. Answer is 60%. Question 15 RBI appointed committee on the development of housing finance securitization market is headed by A. R. K. Jindal. B. D. K. Mohantri. C. Dr. Harsh Varden. D. S. M. T. Usha Throat. Answer is Dr. Harsh Varden. This is it for this video. Thank you so much for your love and support. Stay tuned for the next one. Till then bye and stay blessed.